Hi everybody and welcome back to IVEX Running. I'm Coach Rachel and today we have a one, two, three interval workout for you. If you miss any speed or incline changes, I don't want you to worry because we're gonna have all that displayed for you to see on your screen right over here. And then you will look over onto the opposite side of your screen. You're gonna see this nice long progression bar and that always shows you where we are from start to finish through this whole entire workout. So let's just make sure we have a towel and a water bottle handy because this is a long one. And if you are ready to get sweaty, because we are going to uh, let's look down that tread hit that start button in three in two and one here we go we start two five three five we're just here for a minute warming up yep one two three intervals so this is a 47 minute workout so it's a pretty pretty chunk of change it's a pretty decent amount of time so when we start getting into the jog, I'll give you a breakdown of how the workout's gonna go but for right here right now just inhale through the nose Exhale, let it go. We're about 30 seconds into this first part. So again, two, five, three, five, start adding on just a little bit, right? Start waking the body up, saying, hey, we gotta get ready to run here. So picking up the pace little by little. After this, we got 20 seconds. We're gonna take it into a soft jog to a 4065. 4065, if your uh, tread goes on to a 0.5 on the incline, you can hit that now. Yeah, always try to run on that. We're gonna go. 4065 and three, in two, and one. All right, so 4065, like I said, it's a longer workout today, so don't freak out. You don't have to go right to 65. We have two minutes, we're still in the warm up process, so allow your body to warm up. All right, go slow, start somewhere every 10, 15 seconds, maybe at on point one, point two. All right, so let me break down the workout. One, two, three intervals. Every, we have one, two, three, okay? Let's just say that that's gonna be the standard. A one minute hard run, a two minute run, and a three minute jog, one minute recovery. That's it, that's all we're doing. Those things over and over again, okay? You're like, wait a second, say it again, okay. One minute hard run, two minute regular run, and then a three minute jog. So basically, we start off running really hard, then we take it down a notch, then we take it down a notch, then we walk and recover, and we do it all over again, okay? All right, so from here, we got one minute left. Let's take up the pace again. There we go. Wanna make sure we're nice and warmed up, right? Because after we do our last piece of the warm up, we go right into our first block, and we start with that hard run. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. So we get to walk for the whole last minute. I know, something to look forward to. We have about 30 seconds until we get there. Bum -ba -da -ba. Dum -da -da -da. Squeeze those cores and pump the arms. Inhale through the nose. Exhale, let it go. Last 20 seconds. And then we get to walk it out. 3-0, 4-0. And another eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. All right, 3040. We're here for a minute. We have one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, six rounds. I know it doesn't sound like a lot, but remember, each round is five minutes long. Oh, sorry, six minutes long. Each round is kind of technically. I know we're counting the recovery in for each round, but six rounds without the recovery. Six rounds. Get it together, Rachel. Six minutes, okay, without the recovery. Seven minutes with the recovery. However you want to look at it. All right, so. You gotta get your head in the game. You gotta get your, get your, get your, get your head in the game. Okay? I know. I know, is that good for You can call me. I know if you wanna, you wanna remake that, we can like make it a duet, it's fine. Okay, we also wanna get married, also fine. Here we go, five, four, three, two, we go, five, oh, nine, oh. Come on, come on, five, oh, nine, oh. Listen, you're going hard in this minute. I know my, let me talk about my love for Zach Efron. Might have weirded you out for a minute, but we're here. It's go time, baby. It's time to run. First round. Let's get it done. Oh yeah. Remember, we're here for a minute. The next one, we take off some speed. 
but we go a little longer. Good. How are we feeling? Feeling all right? The first round's always the hardest. So if you're not really awake yet, don't freak out. We're gonna get there. 20 seconds. We go. Four, five, eight, oh. And another. Keep it up, keep it up. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Take it down just a little, just a little. Two minutes now, right? So it's gonna maybe take the first round or two to get used to like the paces and that's okay. Remember, you wanna pace it's challenging but something you can hold for two minutes, okay? Not too easy. Nothing that's gonna gas you out because we got six, five more of these rounds. I know, I don't know if I was counting this one or wasn't counting this one. We're not gonna count it. We're already in it. Keep it going. Good. So, we're already halfway for our, our two minute run. Let it out. We have our three minute jog, okay? And that's a 4 0 to a 7 0. But we're not there yet. So just breathe. You got one minute. Inhale through the nose. Exhale, let it go. You're strong. You are tough. And you pick this workout. So finish, okay? No whiff ins or butt, no crying about it. Oh, what's up? Accidentally pick up my pace more. I'm gonna keep it there. You know, the universe said you're accidentally gonna hit your knob and your speed's gonna increase and you're gonna do it. And I was like, okay, fine, I'm a good listener. Last 30 seconds. Keep running. Pump it up, pump it up. So we go 4 0, 7 0 for three minutes. For some of us, 4 0 is a walk. Just keep that in mind. You have eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Good. We're at three minutes here. I know I had to burp a little bit. It's like I have more, more space to breathe by burping a little. It happens. All right. So. You're dreaming a jog. It's a lot softer, right? <sighs> Your lungs are starting to open up. Yeah, because maybe like the first round, right? Where you only take us to about 10 minutes into the workout. So maybe you weren't really fully warmed up and that is okay. But it's time for action. It's action time. <sighs> Guess what? We're coming up, two minutes left. You get to walk and recover. Now in that recovery, we breathe deep, rejuvenate our souls, right? And then we go forward again. Let's go, two minutes. Pick it up, pick it up, shake out the arms, noodle arms, come on. <sighs> Don't we just love running this time of year? And I said it like that because I don't know when or where <laughs> you are running to this. Let's go, people. Whoop, whoop. Hey. Whoop, whoop. Keep it going, keep it going, keep it going. 90 seconds left. I know, it feels like a little long at the end, but guess what? On the other side of this, you have a one minute walk. Okay? So just a little bit longer. A little bit stronger. Come on, come on. Keep it up, keep it up. So this should be a pace that you can kind of run for for a pretty decent length of time. Last minute. Yeah, this is one. You gotta let everything go. And if you didn't, that's the goal for the workout to learn how to let go. Let go of all the bull crap. Yep. The next 45, 47 minutes, right? They're just for you and only you. 
It's your time. Work it out. Whew. Getting rid of stress, getting rid of it. Getting rid of the stress, anxieties, worldly like pressures that we put on ourselves. And just allowing ourselves to be here in the moment. Torturing ourselves with running. I know, some of you don't have that love yet, and that's okay. I know you don't. It'll happen. And seven, six, five, four, three, two, three, oh, four, oh. I'll say it because I know I didn't always have a love for running. No, no, no. It was like torture. I was like, I would rather squat 500 pounds and run a mile. Life completely changed. Okay, there, it will happen for you. You just got to stay consistent. You got to keep doing it. Running is like a practice makes perfect type of movement. The more you do it, the more you like it. All right, and the better you get. 30 seconds. We start from the beginning. Right? 5 0. 9 0. Remember, we're running six minutes straight, slowly decreasing our pace. We start off hard. 5 0 to 9 0. We go. I know this one minute is nothing, okay? Starting round number two. Here we go. In five. In four. In three. Two. Pick it up, 5 0 9 0. It's only a minute of your life here. You get to pull it back right after this. So think about it. Think about what you want, right? And think about what are the steps to get you to that place, right? Is your goal to be a certain number, to fit into a certain piece of clothing, to just feel a certain type of way, right? How do you get there? What do you gotta do? What are the choices you got to make? Because it doesn't just happen like that. It's not a magic button you push. I know people talk about it. They want the goals. They don't know about the steps, right? Here's the steps. We get to take it back, okay? Four, five, eight, oh. <clears throat> In 10, In nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, Three, two, take it back. Oh man, did it again. I don't know how that happens. Sometimes like, I'll touch my knob, I literally just touch it a smidge. It goes all the way down to zero. If you guys have been with me, I think you know. That's gonna drive me crazy. It's gonna drive me crazy. So I'm like, I lost a second and a half of speed. <laughs> like it really's gonna make a difference in my head. No, it makes so much more, so much of a difference. Let's go. Guess what? You got 90 seconds left. When you're tired, keep running. When you're mad, keep running. Even happy, we run. Let's go. Why? I don't know. I don't know. It just feels right. I said I didn't want the other workouts. You ever have like a really crappy day? And then you go outside and you're like rage running. You're like, beep, beep, ball. Get out of my way. I'm running here. And then you come back and you're like, that's exactly what I needed. Ah. Hey. We do that here. Except I do it with a smile. Okay. Rage running on a treadmill. New song. Rage running on a treadmill. Somebody make it. Drop the beat. You got 30 seconds. We take down the pace again. Our three minute jog. You guys are killing it. So no secret recipe to it, right? This is what it is. You got the gist of it. Now we just complete it. We go 4-0, 7-0, and seven, six, five. Four, three, two. <sighs> this is where you gotta just be. I know, it's the longest chunk of, of time, right? So this is where I would say you're most likely gonna struggle when we get to the second half because you're gonna start wanting to quit. You have this length of three minutes, right? And that's a long time. 
even though the pace is a little bit slower, you have enough time to start to think. The brain starts to work, right? The body settles into the motion. It can handle the speed. So it kind of goes on like a autopilot. So the brain, the brain is kicking into overdrive. So when we get to these jogs, I really want you to think about your thought patterns. Where is your head going? Where is your brain allowing you to go? What direction? Is it telling you, you got this? You want it? It's amazing? We love the pace? Or is it like, oh my God, two minutes and 30 seconds left. Two minutes left. 45 seconds left. Oh my God, when are we gonna be done? Just notice this. Little things, right? That are going to create the self-doubt talk inside of your body. What does that do? It really puts like a, a stress on yourself that is not necessary, right? You create the stress. Just gotta change your thought process. I know, sounds easier said than done, right? That's why when I was saying this jog pace should be comfortable, shouldn't be stressful. All right, enough with the mumbo jumbo. We got one minute left, and then you get to walk. Whew. Keep it up, keep it up. Right, because at first, like, I think coming off the harder run, the first 45 seconds of this three minute jog, you kind of feel, and then you start to settle into it. And then you can kind of go. Towel off, hydrate when necessary. We have 40 seconds, four zero. And then we walk. Three oh, eight oh. How are we feeling? Check in with yourself, your breath, your body. We are okay. We're running it out. Squeezing the core, pumping the arms. Let's go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Take it down, 3040. Walk and recover. Perfect time to grab water, okay? <sighs> Delicious. All right, one minute. Guess what we're doing? We're doing it again. Same thing. Let me know in the comments where you are on your running journey and why you picked this workout today, okay? What was it about it? Was it the time? Was it a one, two, three, the intervals, the name, the pictures, right? Sometimes it's for me, it's the pictures. Like, oh, she looks like she's having fun. I might want to do it. All right, 15 seconds. You ready to do it again? Start with our hard run, okay? 509 L. This is an endurance space workout today, okay? Running for a lot longer of time. Not full power, pulled back. We go in three, two, one. Let's go. 5090. One minute. Breathe. Whew. Round three right here. Come on, come on, come on. It sh should start to feel like if you're on the same paces every single time, which is okay. I'm not gonna be a stickler today about forcing you to go faster on each round. I want you to finish because the time is lengthy, right? If you think about it, six minutes at a clip, that's a lot of time. So I just want you to pick something and I want you to be able to hold it. Let's go, 30 seconds. We take it back down. We go, four, five, eight, oh. You got another 15 seconds. Let it out. We're not holding on to our breath. Come on, come on. You got six, five, four, three, two. Take it down. Four, five, eight, oh. Two minutes. <sighs> Breathe. Allow yourself that big exhale. The pace is changing. Tempo is changing. Your breath is kind of going to change a little bit too, right? <sighs> we try to match our breath to our speed of our body. Right? So a little bit slower. 
a little bit longer breath. Good. And then we're here. Oh yeah, 90 seconds. Keep it going, keep it going. You guys are doing great. Keep it up. I know I'm sweaty. It's starting to get hot here in the summertime. Summertime in New Jersey. You could tell when you go through the videos. If you ever go, you've been with us for a long time. I think you could tell when it starts to get hot in here. Cause it's, I like can't hide my sweatness. I look like I've jumped into a pool. It's happening, it's coming guys. I love that feeling. I know you do too. I sometimes prefer to run the heat. I wanna just get rid of that extra sweat. You know, I don't need it. Get out. I'll replenish you with the good stuff. I'm talking about white claws. Just kidding. Water. Let's go, 30 seconds. We take it down. 4-0. 4-0, And another. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Let's go. Did it again. It is barely touching it. You're being a butthead. Treadmill. Let's go. So you know we record these. I'm in like a basement. There is a spider right behind you guys. It's just taunting me. It's just like look at me while you run. Ha ha. I got all eight of my little legs. Looks like I'm coming right at you. You stay there. Listen. Listen. I'm all for all the animals of the world. Well, bugs, y'all can stay on your side of the room, okay? We got a no touch policy. I won't bother you. You don't bother me. You stay there. I think he understands. Or she. Keep it up, keep it up. How's the pace feel? Feels okay? It's not so bad, right? Are you breathing? Are you holding your breath? So we got two minutes in our three minute jog. Now it's starting to get a little easier. The pace came down. You're breathing. We're working. Keep it up, keep it up. I like when I get to this pace. Cause then I'm like, oh. I'm all right, right? Even in the two minute run, a little freak out mode starts to happen, right? Your muscles start to get a little tight. Breath is tight. When you get to this part, a little peace. All right. You only got one minute left, and then we get to walk. I get to flip the page. Guess what? You got three rounds left after this. And once we finish the next one, it's like a home run. We're about halfway through the workout. Three more rounds, same thing, just three more times. You guys are doing amazing. Just keep it going, right? Halfway there doesn't mean we start to slow down. That means, Figure out what's driving us, right? What's motivating us to be better, to push harder. We fuel that, and then we go, the second half. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, Let's go 3-0-4-0. Walk it out. Oh, baby. All right. Listen. Listen, everybody. It's not going to be easy all the time. Right? That doesn't mean you quit. You're feeling a little stressed out. 
you feel a little tired, that's okay. It's okay. <clears throat> you gotta fight it, right? You have to work through it. It's like you're battling your anxiety. It could be over anything too, man. I think nowadays people get anxiety over almost everything. Untalked about, but it's literally everything. Smallest things make us feel like they're the biggest things. It's just like running. It's not that serious, okay? We can do it. Let's go again. Five, four, three, two, let's go. Five, oh, nine, oh. Pick it up. Six minutes on the clock until you get to walk again. First one is the hardest. Get down and out of the way. And don't forget to smile. Keep working here. Looking good. Guess what? You're halfway there. 30 seconds. Check in with your form when you start getting tired. We start to do some crazy things to keep our body in motion. Naturally, our body tries to make it easier for us, so we start to cheat. Just breathe. Relax the shoulders. Pump the arms. We take it down in eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, let's go. Four, five, eight, oh, two minutes. Already on that two minute run. Stay here, okay? Stay present in the moment. We got this. Okay, we're not stopping the workout early. We're not going to start walking early. You're going to go. You're going to give it everything you got. You deserve it. Okay? Let me just say, I have a, listen, I'm lately, I'm a human being. Okay? I'll do what I got to do. And sometimes I go home and I'm like, I don't even know what it is I want to do with the rest of my time. And I get frustrated, right? So like if you're, if you're, do not know where it is that you want to go physically with your, with your fitness journey, just keep showing up for yourself. Don't stop. All right. Don't quit because it's like the more you keep doing it, the more you have to restart is I know people say it all the time. I know it sounds silly, but it's the truth. Even if you were to just do 15 minutes a day, right you're like i need a break i've been going on this journey for like a year and a half now because that's how i feel sometimes I'm like i'm mentally spent not with running but with other things like i just like been going so hard with this project for so long i need a break but in my head to just not show up and do the thing that i've been training to do for a year and a half just quitting that doesn't make sense in my head so i i go through like what it is, like the skill set of it, right? The thought process of it. Maybe not give it my full energy. I'm still showing up, putting in a little bit of work. So if this is hard today and you're like, you know what? Today, I'm gonna finish this workout because I already started because I know you're gonna do that. It's not even an option to think differently. But tomorrow, I put enough work today. I don't need to work for it tomorrow. I want you to just, Whoop. I want you to change the mindset. We're gonna take it down. Oh, take it down anyways. We overran that one. All right. 4070. Listen, sometimes I'll be talking a lot, okay? I don't remember what I was saying now. Just keep running. Love what you do. Love the skin that you're in. Remember, you only get one of these bodies. You don't get a new one, okay? So if you don't take care of it, and you don't start doing it now, who do you think is gonna do it for you? When are you gonna start doing it for yourself? This is the moment. Look around, breathe it in. Present moment, right here, right now. And as much as it sucks, there is a light at the end of this workout. There is a 
feeling of accomplishment when you're done. I know it was just running, I said. <laughs> just running is not that serious, but you can think about it any way you want to. I believe in you guys. I know what fitness has done for me. I would just love to share it with you guys. I want you to understand that if you're having a hard day, come here, hang out with me. Even though it ain't live, I'm still here for you. I'll pick you up. Can't do the runs for you. I'll try to make you laugh. Okay. One minute. Guess what it comes after this minute? Walk and recover. I'm gonna be honest. I don't know where the spider went. Okay. He was behind the camera. Now he's gone. I'm not gonna lie. He might be on the floor crawling towards me. If you ever see me jump, that's because Mr. Spider decided he wanted to run on the treadmill. I'm not gonna look because I'm not that coordinated, but he was here. Now he's not. I'm nervous he's getting closer to me. <sighs> Yo, that fear of spiders is real though. <laughs> I'm sorry. Some animals were made cute and cuddly. Some animals are made quite scary looking. Five, four, three, two, let's go. Walk it out. Three out, four out. How's that feel? You guys know we're in the home stretch, right? <sighs> two more. That was me looking for him. Maybe he like crawls up my shoulder with you. <sighs> oh. One time I was like, my parents have a house. I'm from Michigan. So they have a house, like we call it up north. So it's like cl close to Lake House. And I'm like, I'm gonna go do yoga outside. <sighs> Let me tell you, I'm like downward facing dog into a plank. Spider right here. I was like, I'm done. I'm done. No spiders. All right. Five. We're going again. Four. Three. Two. Five, oh, nine, oh. You know what's funny is I'm not actually scared of spiders. I just don't. You know what it was one time? I was outside. And I went like this. And there was a spider in my hair. And that thought, I think, just freaked me out. To, like, it still freaks me out. How about... I was in a barn, so it must have crawled on my head, you know? But a spider in the hair! Oh, God. Ugh. Instant need to take a shower. Instantly. We're on our hard run, and you're almost halfway there. I'm going to be honest. That spider put a little pep in my step. I thought I was starting to get tired. No way, Jose. It's just film with a bunch of spiders behind me. I'll run a marathon. Let's go, 15 seconds. We get to take it down for five, eight, oh, and nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Take it down. All right, two minute run here. You guys know we have one more round after this. And then we're done. I can't believe it. Shake out the arms, relax the shoulders, right? Sometimes we start to get a little tired when we start to do this. It also just tenses everything up, makes it even harder. We don't even realize it. So that's why like sometimes you always see me do this, shake out my arms, just so I know what it feels like, right? To like relax them for a minute, see if I'm holding any tension. No, I don't think I'm an inflatable tube guy. Sometimes, just shake it out. Keep it moving. We got one minute left here. Then we take it into our three minute piece. I mean, the finish line is so close. You could probably smell it. it smells like success. Come on, keep squeezing that core. 
keep pumping your arms. <laughs> How are we doing? Check in with yourself, you're all right. 30 seconds, you get to take it down again. So if you're stressed out now, you're gonna go into that softer jog pace. Be able to collect yourself and pull it back in. <clears throat> Here we go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, let's go. 4 0, 7 0. Just run. Run it out. Doing pretty good on miles. How are you guys doing on miles? We're not done. Still got about 10 more minutes of work. Good. 30 seconds in. Two and a half to go. Calmness is starting to settle in, right? <sighs> Bigger inhales. Slower, longer exhales. So if your heart rate was high, we're bringing it back down a little bit, okay? Controlling our breath. Controlling our body. Together, the mind will start to slow, okay? So again, if you're in freak out mode, you pull yourself back together. Two more minutes. And then we go to the last round. I know it's a long workout, but worth it. How good are you gonna feel after you finish this? You pretty much ran the whole entire time. One, two, three, four, five. You ran for pretty much 35 minutes straight. 36, 37 maybe. So if you haven't ran that long ever, I just want you to think about that, okay? Look where you started. Look where you're ending. Look around the room, right? Still alive. <sighs> we got this. And now, last minute here. Then we get to walk. I'm starting to feel it in my core. It's my favorite. We start pumping the arms, the upper abs. Ching, 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 ching. Woo! Listen, I like it. I like the challenge. Some people like them short, quick ones, right? Those one minute intervals. Those are challenging also, but I think because of the time for me, anything that's over three minutes of running straight is challenging for me. It's like, I could do the short burst, no problem. Those longer ones, when the mind starts to creep in, listen, but I'm noticing it, but that doesn't mean that I stop. That doesn't mean that I quit. Three, two, take it down, okay? 3040. It just means that I notice, I just notice like my behavior patterns in my own body. And how do you gotta get how do you want to get better at something? Or how do you get better at something? You keep practicing. So I know that me running for longer periods of time is harder for me, so these are the best workouts. You see endurance space running? Any any of the titles? Those are the ones for you. If you're more of a slow and steady wins the race type of person and going full power for, for speed for a shorter period of time, go to the little intervals. But always switch it up every now and then. Keep your body guessing. You ready for the last round? Here we go. One minute hard run. 5 0, 9 0, and 3, 2, one, pick it up, baby, let's go. Listen, you finish the six minutes, finito. We're done. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up, keep it up.
left side. Keep it going. Just keep riding. I wonder. Listen, I'm just reading the paper. Keep going. Nothing happened. 15 seconds. Bonus round. Here we go. In eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Let's go. Take it down. Four, five, eight, oh. How you feeling? Feeling okay? I thought I messed up, but I didn't. That's why I was quiet. <laughs> Listen, when Rachel messes up, I'll just get real quiet. <laughs> I didn't, though. Da, da, da. Here we go. Keep running. <sighs> well, you finish that one with ease. You know? I know it was the, the look of confusion on my face. <laughs> You're like, I don't know what's wrong with her. I'm just gonna run. Grab it. Let's go. Just think, guys. We're two minutes in. Four more to go. Okay? One more minute at this pace. And then we take it down for the last three minutes. You got it. You got it. You got it. You got it. Squeeze, breathe, let's work. 45 seconds left. How those lungs feel? How the shoulders feel? The hips in the back, knees, everything Gucci? Okay, keep it up, keep it up. Get ready to take it down, 4-0. Seven zero, oh, three minute, your last running piece. We take it down to a jog, okay? Only thing between you and the finish line is three minutes. We go there in three, two, one. Three minutes. Just breathe. First minute, allow your body to adjust to the pace, okay? It is slower. Allow yourself some time to settle in. There is a place of enjoyment in this pace. You just gotta get there. I find that mine about like 30 seconds in, it kind of feels like I could keep running forever after that. I'm not like thinking, when is it gonna be done? Keep going, keep running, keep working. Nobody said to stop yet. So if you did, pick it right back up. Nobody said, quit, not an option. You go hard, five, four, three, two minutes left, let's go. I don't know why I was counting it down. Just trying to keep you on your tiptoes. Two minutes. <clears throat> How you feeling? Now you get it? Now you feel it. Now you're settled in. You're smiling. I know. You're like, Rachel, you, you did it again. I did it again, guys. Made you like running. Come on, come on. 90 seconds left. And then we don't stop. Just kidding, this is a 90 minute workout. Joking, joking. We're coming up on that last minute though. You ready? Look at me. 60 seconds of running left on the clock. In three, two, just go. Just go. You've been running this whole entire time. What's an extra 60 seconds? I'm proud of you guys. Be proud of yourself and don't stop. Don't give up. Don't even look down, all right? Just keep looking forward at that screen. 
Keep your eye on the prize. You have 30 seconds till you reach that finish line. 30 seconds. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. 20. You can count with me on the last 10 if you want. Get ready, here it comes. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 3, 0, 4, 0. Oh. Ooh, baby. You made it. Here for a minute. We cool down for another minute. 3, 0, 4, 0. Oh. Listen. Okay. We did it. How are we feeling? Sweaty? Drip mode. 30 seconds, we take it down. Two, five, three, five. Now over here, a little recap, right? Six rounds, everything was the same. All interval for one minute, two minute, three minutes. The shorter periods, faster the speed. No breaks in between, that's why it's hard, right? It's like a little less pressure, a little less pressure, a little less pressure, but the whole thing is work. All right, so even though the pace got easier, Still put in the work, baby. Here we go. Two, five, three, five, three, two, one. Take it down. Full cool down. <sighs> this is where you're like, oh my God, two, five. Sometimes we get on the treadmill, we start off like at a two or a three, and you're thinking that you're moving really fast. And now, like at the end of the workout, you're like, I'm moving in slow motion. All right. Those are our one, two, three intervals, right? 47 minute workout. <sighs> Please like, share, and subscribe. Tell all your friends. Tell everybody about it, right? Trying to change the world one stride at a time. Yeah, baby. Uh huh. All right. You got about 25 seconds. Remember that you ran, okay? You put some pressure, you put some, you banged up your body a little bit. So do the nice thing. Hydrate, stretch it out. Maybe get a little massage. You got to be the yin to the yang. Beat it up, be nice to it. Okay? All right. You can hit that soft one and another five. Four, we can keep on walking if you want to, but if not, three, two, one. This is Ibex running. I'm Coach Rachel, so one, two, three interval workout, and I'll see you next time.